to drop the puck on this one. The Capitals have won the draw, and we are now underway. Detroit's got the puck. Larkin's got it in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Kane. Oh, he'll walk that one back as he just puts it wide right in the slot. Well, not a lot of time from that area, especially when you're in the middle of the ice, the golden area, as we call it. But he's got someone on him, but he gets rid of it quick. Just misses. Knocked away with the stick by Larkin. Siders taking it from his own end. Quick pass to Wallman. Slides the puck across to Larkin. On the attack along the boards. All quick work with the stick and comes up with the puck. The Capitals will play it in their own end. Takes the feed up ahead. With some open space at center. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. Into the middle of the neutral zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Here they come on the attack down the right side. And the puck skips away after that move. All right, hold on, James. Looks like there's going to be a call right there. Moves it to Larkin. Close save. Somehow got a piece of it. Let's get the call. The Capitals are off to the box. Interference the call. Here's a first look at the power play. Scoreless game right now, James, but an opportunity on the power play. You have to find a way to convert. Move that puck quickly and open up lanes. Beat the goaltender, but couldn't beat the post. Gotta love offense, James, and the ability to score goals. And this one just goes right off the pipe. That's frustrating. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. McMichael's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Detroit's won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Turned aside with the glove. Goaltender covers up and will get a faceoff. Comfer's ready for the draw on this man advantage. Detroit's won the draw and they'll go to work. Here's a short pass to Gustafsson. Oh, he made the save. How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. Such an impressive save, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position. It's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out battling and out willing everyone around you. Scarbosa's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Detroit's won it. And now it's grabbed by Gostas Bear. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Alexiev. Into the offensive end now. And he takes the dish. Sends the pass over. Takes the feet at the back end. Comes up with the stop. Oh, another great save right there. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one and then the second save. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Tries to feed it over to Perron. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Comfort. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Well, goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Scores! No mistake on that one. The clinical power play goal. What a goal. 
I'm surprised he didn't snap his twig in half after that snapper there, James. I mean, the force at which he bore down with, it's incredible how much power he can get from his wrist and transfer of weight. Detroit's got to be pleased with the way they've started tonight. Look at this. Already the first goal of the game and just trying to take that crowd out of it. Well, yeah, and that's exactly what they've done. And that would have been the message from the coach earlier today, James, because you want to make sure that you set the tone. You control the pace of play and you find a way to get on the board first. Offside the call. We'll get a face-off coming up. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We got a one nothing game to this point. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Sends the pass in front. Oh, and he whiffs on it. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. And it takes a shot. Oh, denied on the play. Wow. Uh, the true competitor is saved just when you think that he's completely out of it. And here we go. His the goal players out there right off the bat to start this game. And you know that it's going to be a good one. A lot of physicality if this is what it's starting like. Well, a spirited scrap comes to an end with the takedown. I think he might be relieved as they head to the ice as he was taking a thrashing. <laughs> I think you're right. Not difficult to see who won that fight. The W goes the road team all the way. Detroit's got it and they're on the attack. And that takes guts to get in front of that one. Quick feed to Perron. And that's blocked. Lindgren's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Protus is ready for the face-off as they'll continue to kill off this penalty. Comfers won the face-off here in the offensive zone. Takes the feed. Washington's got the puck along the wall. Gets it out of his own end. Detroit's regained possession of the puck. Sends one up to Raymond. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. The Capitals have been picking off passes left, right, and center. You know the coach is going to like this, but it has to transition to offense. Well, this game's awfully close. Musa quickly over to Raymond. Takes it to the net, and he makes the save. Handles the puck at the point. Quick pass to Gustafsson. The lane was plugged up, and that shot's blocked. Washington's got possession of the puck. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. And he takes the feed. Trying to get it out of their own end. And he's able to move the puck across the blue line and out of harm's way. Larkin's pass was so difficult, James. I mean, he stumbles, so he's off balance, and he's still able to corral the puck and get it off with precision to the shooter. That leads to a great scoring chance. Detroit's got a hold of it along the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Takes the pass. Too many bodies in the way. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Big time save! Oh, my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time, it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Well, as play continues... Can you feel the love tonight? Listen to this place here, Cheryl. I can feel it. You can feel it. And he can feel it after that last save. Because you know what fans appreciate? They appreciate effort, James. And that's how that save was made. Such a tough penalty to take when the game's within reach. They're looking for the equalizer. And now they find themselves shorthanded. Not a lot of time to work, but they still have a five-on-three. Well, a short five on three here, but you still have a time to strike. Not even once, but possibly twice. you got to get it on your stick, drive it through the net. And they managed to clear it. 
LaPierre's penalty has expired, but they remain shorthanded as he joins the kill. Cuts to the paint. Denied by the goaltender. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Passes on over to Fabry. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Moves it to Kane. Oh, he got puddled by Lindgren. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Here's a short pass to Sider. Takes a shot. Stick save. Just got a piece of it with that one. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. And some physicality here. And it's picked up by the defense. They could really use a clear here. And they get a clear as it goes off the boards and out. The Red Wings are on the attack. Quick feed to Fabry. Sets the feed in front. The shot. And he keeps that one out. Dabrinkit's been feeling it, James. He got the go-ahead goal, and now the puck's on his stick. And now it's over to Sider. Washington's got the puck. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Puts it on net. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. Came up with the save on that play. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Fires it on net. Oh, what a stop with the pad by Lyon. Larkin's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. And there's another penalty call against the home team. These fans are frustrated. Cheryl, I think these calls are legit. I just think that the fans are wondering, what about the other side here? Well, yeah, and they got to be expecting to get one soon here as it is one side. And it's so hard for a team to get into the game when there's no flow because you keep raiding yourself to the box. I love the 1 3 1 set on the power play unit they used earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored, but there's so many variations off of it. I love the. And the power play comes up big again. I love the various options that they have on their power play, James. Once the PK adjusts to one, they hit the other. You see players taking this shot all the time in practice with their skill coaches, and I'm telling you right now, this is perfect execution. Shooting in stride. Quick snap of the wrist and putting it in the back of the net. Got to see where you want to be. His head was up the whole time. And they win that neutral zone draw. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. The Red Wings gain possession in their own end. And he takes the feed. Here's a chance. Answers it with an even better save. Trying to clear from the defensive zone. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. The Red Wings looking against the half wall. And a smart heads up read to come up with the puck. The Capitals are doing a great job of anticipating the play. And that's why the puck is on their stick. They're intercepting pucks all game long. They've got to make good on them. They've got to transfer it, head north, and start cashing in. Pad save, and he made it look easy. Great job there. Nice job to escape the zone. The Capitals will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Knocks the puck loose. The Red Wings gain control of the puck. Because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck, just incredible save, James. Now, they always say, to be great, you have to get uncomfortable. As we look at this last save, this looks uncomfortable. Stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save, that's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Fabry's ready to take the draw here on this power play. The Capitals win the draw here in their own end. 
Lindgren's last save was outstanding, James. I mean, it's a valiant effort. That's what gets it done. It's beyond the skill to be able to make a save. It is the will and the compete level that energizes everyone around him. for the desperation save to compete the will to keep that puck out of the net and they're really showing him the love can they capitalize on this power play here comes the face off and off the draw they'll take possession poked away in the offensive zone by Kane Puck move back to the neutral zone. Quick pass to Strong. Moves it over to Kane. The Red Wings carry it along the wall. Here he is in close. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Well, he's got vision and he's got creativity, but you got to have the skill set in terms of the hands to be able to make a difference and have an impact, and that's exactly what he does as he drives into the net. But the goaltender keeps him at bay. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Tremendous intensity here in the offensive zone. Comfer's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Detroit's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Blocked in front. They move the puck out of harm's way. Looking to break out here on the power play. Over the line they come. Quick shot. And save it up. You. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Slick feed. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Lindgren's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Comfers at the faceoff dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Detroit's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Lindgren's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. McMichael's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Capitals win the defensive zone faceoff. Setting up behind his own net now. Jensen's almost ready to get back on the ice. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Sends a pass over. Textbook poke check by Sandine. The Red Wings fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. That's a great job by the PK to have the ability to be aggressive and strong on the puck. And he takes the pass. To bring it. Oh, puts it off the iron. Had the side of the net, but doesn't go. Raymond's been effective getting to the right places at the right time, but it hits the post. Gun. Scores! He shows no signs of slowing down. Alex Ovechkin. As a goaltender, you're always working on different exercise, tracking with your eyes, foot movements, everything that power pushes you across the crease. And unfortunately, this time, he's just too slow getting across, and it hits him and goes to the back of the net. 
Washington's got to be feeling good after getting that one, Cheryl. Well, they're certainly feeling good about themselves now, James. The body language has changed. They're on their toes. The confidence has lifted. It's a much-needed offense to get them within one. Poked away at center by Van Riemsdyk. Angles it over to Petrie. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Smart defensive play there. Washington's looking to break out. Moves it to Van Riemsdyk. Solid check to slow him down. And he loses control of the puck. Washington's gained possession along the boards. Delayed penalty looming. Whistle stops the play. Well, that's a frustration penalty. I've taken many of those in my day, James. It's going to be the cross-checking penalty. Once you extend your arms, you're in trouble. Washington's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Comfer's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Red Wings win the faceoff. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Washington's got a hold of the puck now. Here's a short pass to Sandine. Shot! Denies him in close. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time? You want to take space? Goaltender does it, makes a save. Ovechkin's aware that he needs to step up for his team, guys. His zone ability is one part of his game that can help his team close this gap. Clearing attempt. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Washington's got the puck in their own end. Handles the pass. Takes a shot. Stops that one. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Fishers recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Detroit's won the defensive zone draw. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Dumps it into the ozone. Washington's got the puck along the boards. Across the line and on the attack. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. The Red Wings gain possession of the defensive zone. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Washington's got it in their own zone. Some good stick work to force that turnover. Gains the zone through center. Takes a shot off a stick. Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Washington's got a hold of it against the wall. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Shot! And there's the save! Picked up along the boards by Mantha. And that goes off a body. Here's a shot! Scores! They tied it up! Opportunity knocking, and they take advantage of the power play! Well, you spend so much time in practice working on it because you want to have different layers to throw off the PK units, and I thought they did a real effective job of reading what they were giving, and then they were able to bury it. This power play was relentless, James, applying a ton of pressure on their opponent. This PK unit is worn down and tired. Why? Every time that it didn't go in, they were able to retrieve it. They hound pucks, two on it, and eventually it made its way in. Well past the midway mark of this period, we got a tie game. Detroit's won the faceoff at center. Takes the feed. Quick feed to Comper. Receives the pass. Ring is hauled down. Penalty on the way. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. When you're the culprit and you're going to the box for the second time in one period, you recognize that you've also compromised your team here. It's a team sport. And man, they're not happy right now. Detroit's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. 
Well, they worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. And man, has it been effective. And that was off a player in front. Taken along the wall by Larkin. Popped away by the goaltender. Well, he's really feeling a play from earlier on the shift, James. And now he's wincing on his way back to the bench. He's going to need some assistance here to get off the ice. left the game James and he's heading down the tunnel grabbing his upper body it looks like his arm I mean he is really laboring and needs assistance as he walks down and that's a critical blow to the lineup there Scarposis won the draw here in the defensive zone Detroit's got the puck along the wall Scores! and they've gone in front thanks to the power play goal well, it's all about manipulating the PK, and that's what they did so well to take advantage of that opportunity. Well, he makes a beautiful play for this goal, James. It's all in the pass, his deception, and he really eludes his defender with his eyes. Then he's got his hands as an extension of his body, and how about his feet? Everything is moving, his awareness is off the charts, and as a result, they get the goal. Detroit's taken a one-goal lead here in the back half of period number one. Well, you can certainly tell that they came ready to play right from the onset of this game. It's been a tight game. They've stayed the course here. They competed for every puck, and they found ways to get it through to the net, James. I love the way that they're shooting at all costs. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And he takes the dish. Tries to get it to McMichael. Here they are on the attack. Big time stop. Lions all over that save. I mean, he's dialed in and he recognizes where he has to be at the right time. And he's ridden off the puck. Moves it to the middle. Picked off in front. Now he takes it over the line. Shot. Oh, gets a blocker on it to turn it away. The Capitals have it now. Protus takes it into the offensive end. Grabbed along the board by Jensen. Handles the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a shot. Denies him with the pad. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. The Red Wings have been the dominant team here midway through the first period, and they lead it. Washington's won the draw. Drives to the sweet spot. Puck grabbed by Kane. Detroit's crossed the line and on the attack. Shot! Oh, he had a beat, but it goes off the inside post. The Red Wings recognize that they have the lead, but also you don't get tons of great looks in a game, and this scores! And we are tied. New game here, Pony. Oh, yeah, it's a new game, James. Uh, but I really like the pushback to get the equalizer, and now it's what they do with that momentum. This next shift, it's critical. This goal is a reminder of how fast the game actually is played, James. I mean, you get an opportunity at one end. Everyone is pushing for the goal. When you miss, though, the quick counter, the speed in transition, it what makes the difference. But you got to capitalize at the other end, and that's exactly what happened. Past the midway mark in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Washington's won the draw in the neutral zone. Pushes it across to Strom. Puts it on in. Oh, CP, you know what he wanted there. Just came up a little wide. Well, JC certainly did. He pulled it into his body, and as he corrals it, he lets it rip. But hockey's a game of inches, and that one just misses. And we play on. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it around along the half wall. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. The Red Wings look to start the transition game. Gains the zone. Back to the blue line. Here's a chance in front. He scores! What a goal! Well, 
Well, this is an unlucky bounce, James. I mean, when you're a goaltender, you play your angles, you know your set positions, but you can't get set in a scramble like this, and it winds up in the back of the net. The Red Wings are up by one here in the back half of the opening frame after that strike. Well, and you know that the strategy has been one thing. Put the puck to the net, and they have owned the shot share in the opening frame. No question about it, James. Now they find themselves with a one-goal lead. they got to continue to press to see if they can extend it. And he shuts the door on that. The Capitals gain possession. Pass to Wilson. Nice zone entry from the right side. Pinned up along the boards. The Red Wings will play it from the defensive zone. The Capitals have it now. One-timer denies him on the slaughter. Across the line along the left wall. And he makes the save. Moves the puck. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. The Red Wings have it from their own end. Picked up along the wall by Fabry. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Turned aside with the glove by Lindgren. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes. He does that and makes the save. Comfers won the draw and they're on the attack. Musa quickly over to Scarbosa. Puck picked up by Malenston. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Washington's looking to break out of their own end. Slides the puck over. Fires it on net. Oh, and there's a great save by Lyon. Sends the pass over. Here's a chance. He scores! What a goal! Two quick goals in a minute 30, James. Anybody who just got up for a quick snack is probably looking at the scoreboard going, what happened? Well, don't blink. The game can change in an instant. Absolutely. James, the credit always goes to the goal scorer, but how about this beautiful deke and gift of a pass? I mean, knowing how to draw the coverage to you, that is creativity at its finest. Perron's earlier injury is going to keep him out of the game, James. We've just received confirmation from the staff, and this isn't good. Not good at all. Uh, huge blow for the team, and, and somebody who's just so well-liked, too, right? Those intangibles that he brings on the bench as well at times like this. Yeah. Don't like seeing that at all. Fires it, and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. Quick shot. Oh, wow, what a pad saved by Lindgren. In the final moments of this period, Detroit's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Great reach with the stick by Larkin. Odd man rush. Well, it's a game of inches, isn't it? And this time, those inches, they work in his favor. They go right into the net. Detroit's looked great thus far, leading here late in the first period. McMichaels won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. And he's right there with the blocker to keep it out. Can't hang on after that hit. Takes the feed. No room for that one to get through. It's pretty clear that he's hurt, James, as he's laboring towards the bench, and it is a struggle. Someone's going to have to help him get off. Quick pass to Debrinkit. 
And that's deflected. Oh, what a stick save. The Capitals move the puck in the defensive zone. Through center along the wing. From the open ice, they gain the line. And he totally whips on that one. And that one's denied. Taken by Dabrinkit. Denies him again. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Poked away by Sherratt. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Takes a shot. And that goes off a stick somewhere in traffic. The Red Wings take it along the wall. With the steal. Wilson's got it along the boards. Here's a shot. Here's a shot. And there's a glove save on the play. The Red Wings have controlled this game here in the first period. More shots, more goals. The Capitals win the draw. And that doesn't reach the net. And just like that comes up with the puck. Great little flick of the stick. Gaining steam here on the attack. Takes a shot. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Sandine's caught with the hook and the official saw it. And let's see what the call is. Some fragile timing here, James, at the end of the period. It's a close game. The peak airs have to get to work. They can get some rest in the intermission, and they can start the next period. Well, I expect that they're going to go back to the umbrella formation, James. They had success earlier on it on the power play with three up high trying to move the coverage. Hey, for everyone who wants to draw it up, it's exactly what it looks like, the top of an umbrella, and then you're getting the coverage to move around, and then you can use those cross-seam passes, and you can ski downhill for a shot as well. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. The Capitals pick up steam and are on the attack. Slides it back to the blue line. Jostling for the puck, but still moves away. The Capitals take over on possession. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Fisher's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Washington's got possession of the puck. Obey Kubel's working it around in the corner. Oh, what a stop with the stick by Lyon. Joss is the puck loose. And now it's grabbed by Sider. Puck clears the zone. Taken by Sandine. Slides it diagonally to Obey Kubel. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. The Red Wings have possession shorthanded. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Great poke check on the reach. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Shoot the puck. Shot, big stop, just as time expires in the period. Well, fun start to this one as period number one comes to an end. We've still got lots more still in store. Kids are coming out on the ice here to play the little mini prospects game. And we'll be back with more in a moment. Mantha's out for the remainder of the game, James, with that injury he suffered earlier. We just received word from the staff that he will be out for an indefinite amount of time. An unfortunate storyline here throughout the game, and 
Now we know for sure he won't be back. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. One last rush here on this power play. Shoots it. Huge stop by Lindgren. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Comfer's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Good heads-up play to sneak in there on the tie-up and come up with the puck. Drives it to the crease. How did he stop that one? Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Then they clear the puck from the zone. Now the PK unit has to be aware of where everyone is, whether they're in the middle of the ice, whether they're on the wall, and the angle at which they uh, take it off to glass to make sure they get it outside the blue line. And a great save! Good fight for the puck along the boards. Moves it to Carlson. And he takes the feed. Keeps possession on the play. Cops gaining momentum. They put the puck into the offensive end. Clear the puck. And some good footwork to kick it away. Pacioretty's lugging the puck. The Capitals played along the boards. Denies him! Scooped up along the wall by Strom. Sends the feet in front. And that's stuck. No, it's in. It's in. Looks like he had it, but not the case. There's a reason why coaches talk about crisp passing and execution. They get angry and you skate in practice if it isn't on the tape. He puts on a clinic here in distribution and it winds up as a goal. The Capitals have shifted momentum after that equalizer. They seem to be moving a lot better as well as executing with the puck. And that's something that is critical as they move through this game. And it's a reason why they got the equalizer. Lapierre's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. Sandine's going to play it against the half wall. Great defensive effort with the stick. To break it, stick handling in his own zone. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. And it's kicked away. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Makes a move in front. Stopped by the goaltender. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. Still plenty of time left in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Can't connect. Broken up with a stick. Protus carries the puck in his own zone. Drives to the paint. Detroit's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Sherratt's tripped up, and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Goaltender's at the bench with the delayed penalty being called. They've got an extra attacker now on the ice. And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Detroit's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, sometimes it can be frustrating and it can give you energy, and this power play has just been average tonight, James. But the good thing, they have an opportunity right here to get above average. Tough save by the goalie. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Protus gets set for the face-off here as they will continue to play shorthanded. The Capitals take possession off the faceoff. Picked up along the boards by Protus. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Play is blown dead with the offside. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. The Red Wings win the draw. 
Long reach breaks up the momentum. And the puck clears the zone. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. The Red Wings are in transition. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Handles a sweet feed. Almost right there on a platter and the stick breaks. Well, it was there for the taking. The setup was perfect. The angle and then the twig just shatters. Here's a short pass to Copper. Oh, he saved it. What a stop. Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. And as play continues, listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And, hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. Pacioretty's the victim of a slash, and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. Kane's going off to the box for two minutes. They'll play some four-on-four. Four-on-four, four. Four four, you want to utilize north, south, east, west and capitalize on the speed with the extra ice available. You can bet your coaching staff is going to put some pretty quick players out there. Sider's got the puck in his own zone. The Red Wings play it along the wing. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. The Capitals cross the blue line and are on the attack. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. Washington's got control of it now from the road end. Here he comes, in on a breakaway. Hits the post. Uh, and what an opportunity there as he looks to shoot that puck. He's in good position. He can see exactly where he wants to go. Just misses. The Red Wings gain control of the puck. Nice zone entry on the left side. Quick feed to Petrie. Takes the pass. Comfer's already got three points in this game, James, really leading the way offensively, and you have to wonder how many more he's going to get if he continues to handle the puck the way he is. And Reemsdijk's moving the puck through his own zone. Moves it quickly over to Obey Cabell. Look at this! Steps inside! Takes a shot! Oh, it's stopped! Oh, my goodness, what a save! Lindgren's going to hang on for a whistle. Larkin's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Washington's got possession here in their own end. Looks to pass it to LaPierre. And he takes the feed. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Detroit's got it along the wall. Larkin's got it in the offensive zone. Redirect the shot. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, now they're in front, James, so they'll have some energy. You know that their first few strides will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. When it's a tie game, all you want to do when you're on the PK is make sure it remains that way. And it's an effective kill, but it winds up going north. They break the tie. They get the shorthanded goal. That's an effective PK. The Red Wings have gone in front by one here in the second period. Yeah, and it certainly changes the mindset when you're ahead by one in a very close deadlock game, James. Now they got to push the pace, put the pedal to the metal, and try and figure out a way to cash in again. Larkins won the draw at center. Siders picking up steam. Puck dumped in. The Capitals scoop it up along the boards. Up along the wing. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Shot, and that's blocked from someone in front. Rasmussen's got it in the defensive end. And the puck leaves the zone. Kane's penalty is almost expired. Washington's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. The expectation when you're on the power play is to score a goal, not give up one, James. This is a tough one to take for this group. 
The Red Wings have been impressive to watch tonight. They've had a lot of shots on net, and they lead it here in the second. Washington's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Pacioretty's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Works it across to Sandine. Cut into the front of the net. Stopped by the goaltender. Listen, Jane, the shooter's in the slot. This is as high danger as it can get, and he challenges. He's set, ready to go in great position and makes the save as a result. Looks like lineups are set, and they're ready to get things back underway. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And he denied that opportunity. Gostas Bears taking it from his own end. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Quick pass across to Ovechkin. And he can't hang on after that hit. And that snapped away in the defensive end by Mata. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Quick pass to Valeno. Too much traffic in the lane. Right in front of the official's eyes and the hand is in the air. They got to put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no question about it. But they got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. The Capitals once again send out their power play unit. Well, they create a power play opportunity with hard work, and now it's an opportunity to get back in this game, James. Finding a way to move the puck quickly and create seams to get shots on net. Lions going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Fishers recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. McMichaels won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. And that goes off a player. Washington's gained possession along the boards. The Red Wings will kill off a few extra seconds now. And they get that puck down the ice. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Tries to get the puck over to Milano. Slides it diagonally to Molenston. And that's off target as it hits a body. Detroit's got the puck shorthanded. And they get the puck out. Washington's got the puck. Moves it to McMichael. Feeds it over to Sandine. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Center and feed. Couldn't complete the pass. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. And they put it off the glass and out. Well, the shorthanded unit, they find a way to get to this puck first, James. And the tough part there is got to get it on your stick and off your stick quick. As you know, the power play unit is going to be coming. This is done perfectly. He tips it. Here's a chance. They score. And the way they own the puck, the precision in the movements, the motion in the offensive zone, and they cash in to tie this game. Just a fabulous goal, Jane, with a lot of elements woven into it. I mean, he's stumbling, so he almost falls, but he's able to get a shot off just in time. He's able to hold himself up and get that shot off. His hands away from his body, not in the greatest position, but he manages to find the back of the net. And the setters glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. won the draw let's see what they can do with possession slick feed here he is in close tremendous stop by Lindgren a player should never be left alone in the slot but man is the goaltender to task here gets out in front of it and makes the save puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone delayed penalty coming up here Puck scooped up by Wilson. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more.
Washington's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. The power play creates so much energy, and when it's just average, you can feel a bit deflated. Everyone expects a power play to score all the time. Guess what? It doesn't. Here's a short pass to Carlson. And that's broken up. Back to the point it goes. The Capitals have it in the offensive end. Turn that chance aside. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Carlson. Quick feed to Strom. To the front! Detroit's got possession while undermanned. The Capitals have it in the offensive zone. Scores! It's a power play goal and it puts them in front. Well, that's perfect execution. You have that player advantage. You gotta use it. They did it. Now they're ahead. Oh, James, I just love this goal. It shows all the elements in the game of hockey. You have to have spatial awareness. You have to have your head up to know exactly where you want to move the puck before you do and this is a perfect example as he is stumbling and recognizes that he's got to get that stick to puck and move that pass right to the open player immediately does it and as a result it's in the back of the net the red wings need to find a way to convert on one of these scoring chances as they trail here in period number two slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up the Red Wings will play it against the wall. Hammers it on there. Scores! And we are back to even. Yeah, tie game now, James. I really like the energy that they've showed throughout the game, but now it's about channeling the energy they've just created and doing something with it. Well, the goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. I thought that he was set to position. Just the blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. Larkins won the draw. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Scoops up the puck now. Sends a pass over. Looking to set up offensively. Wilson's got it along the wing. And he takes the pass. Denies him. He got all of it. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Pinned up along the boards. From the right side. Moves it up ahead. Siders got it against the boards. Washington's got the puck in their own end. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. And that's intercepted by Kane. Puck grab by Sider. Feeds it on over to Larkin. Quick pass to Debrinkit. Here's a shot. And that one's turned away. There's the whistle as the net comes off. Detroit's got possession of the puck after that neutral zone face-off. Moves it quickly over to Valeno. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. He needs to find a way to manage his emotions here because they're creeping into his game. That's a second penalty he's taken this period. unit goes right back to work power play has just been average tonight james but hey it hasn't been in the basement right mcmichaels won the draw here and they'll go on the attack and he turns that one aside tries to feed it over to mcmichael nowhere for that shot to go through trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end the Capitals gain the zone. Moves it to Milano. Denied by the goaltender. Oh, and he misfires on that and makes the save. Here's the clearing attempt. Gets it out of his own end. Retrieves the puck. Try to kickstart this power play. 
Great hands to handle the saucer feed. And a smart heads-up play to poke that away by Petrie. Directs it on over to Molenston. Poked away in the neutral zone by Comper. Puck picked up by Sandine. Passes it to Scarbosa. And he slides it quickly to Milano. Shot! Here's a shot! Oh, what a glove save! Stretching out! That was incredible! Larkin's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Washington's got it, and they're on the attack. That's a beautiful pad save by the goalie there. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Strom's ready to take the draw here on this power play. The Red Wings win the draw. Detroit's penalty killers get a hold of it. Here's a chance to move the puck outside the zone. Oh, and it's a fail on that clearing attempt as it's kept in. Well, that won't keep you on the PK, that's for sure, James. The coach wants that puck out, and it's on your stick. you got to make sure that it goes 200 feet down the ice. Larkin's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Capitals win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Denies that opportunity. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Handles the pass. Wilson's been such a dangerous player on the power play. Already has a goal there, and they'll be looking to execute again. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Strom's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. The Capitals will go to work here in the offensive zone. Detroit's looking to break out. They clear the zone. The Capitals have it against the wall. Sends it over to Wilson. Return pass. The Capitals fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. You know how you change an average peak? Scores! And three is the magic number. There's the hat trick. And I think there's going to have to be an extra stoppage in play here as they collect all of the hats on the ice at home. He gets it a shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the goalie to get set up and puts it home. Washington's got a one goal lead after that goal here in period number two. And I think they answered the call from the coaching staff that were just laying into them on the bench to be more assertive, more aggressive, and hold on to the puck. They answer the call, they get the lead. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. The Capitals gain possession along the wall. The Red Wings take possession in the neutral zone. Sider's got the puck. Takes the feed. The Capitals look to start the transition game. Takes it across the blue line. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many moves and he loses the puck. Throws it in. Washington's got it in their own zone. The Capitals take it along the wall. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Receives the pass. Puts it on net. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. The Red Wings really need to find a way to start finishing on some of these scoring chances because they trail here in the middle. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Hard hit, frees up the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Kane. Pokes it away in his own end. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Fires it on net. Big time stop there. Battling for it along the boards. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Larkin. 
Denied by the defender. Nice block. Here's a short pass to Sandine. Oh, look at the glove saved by Lyon. Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. Detroit's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And there's the save on the play. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Detroit's got it in their own zone. The Capitals gain control of the puck against the wall. Look at this attack. It's smothering here, and the fans are loving it. And they skate it out of the danger zone. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. This is not the way they wanted the game to go. Just undisciplined, taking a ton of penalties. They'll have to reset and refocus if they want to find a way to get on top. Detroit's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. Battle along the boards. The Capitals get a hold of the puck under man. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. The Red Wings have it now. He looks deep to Sprong. Here they come up along the wing. Along the half wall with the puck. And that was stopped. And he takes the dish. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Looking to break out here on the power play. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. That's how you get north in a hurry. Fantastic stretch pass. Trying to clear. And they take care of business on the play. The Red Wings play it along the boards. The Capitals move it in. Detroit's got the puck along the boards. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Well, we know the time on ice numbers are all going to the penalty killers here, James, because it has been an onset, a parade to the penalty box. They've got to find a way to play even strength. The Red Wings could really open things up with a five-on-three power play. Power play has scored once, James, but, man, it has not been pretty. And you got to give a lot of credit to the PKers on the other side, but their opponents, the ones on the power play, they have to find a way to execute. Oh, that goes off his mask. Well, James, that brings new meaning to putting everything in front of the puck to make a save as it goes off of his mask. Not sure if he's rattled right there, but he shakes it off and he gets the save. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Scarbosa's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. They win the face-off here in their own end and take possession. The Capitals have it now. Puck slid down the ice. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, this is a critical juncture of the game. You've got the one-goal lead, and now you take a penalty. The PK unit has to be the task and kill this off. Roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. The long five on three, yes, you have more time, and you know that you've worked on this in practice. The coach wants you to be patient with the puck, but they want you to find an opportunity to drive and attack. You have to move it, or you have to fire it. Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. Angles it over to Sprong. The Red Wings take it across the line. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Takes it into the slot, and he gets just enough to keep it out. Scores! And the power play works to perfection as they've tied it up. Well, the power play unit knew what was at stake. They knew that they had an opportunity to get the equalizer in this game, and they executed perfectly.
This is a great power play goal, James. They have the execution in terms of their passing along the outside, and then they attack the net with a shot. You have to have net front presence and create a screen. That's exactly what they have, and they capitalize as a result. The Red Wings have tied things up after that snipe, and this has been back and forth all night. Yeah, I just love it, James. And they put themselves in a good position here as they get the equalizer nearing the end of the second. They'll have a lot to talk about in the intermission heading into the third. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. The Red Wings gain possession. Through center. Great heads up play with the stick by Alexiev. Washington's got a chance to work the transition game now shorthanded. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Works it across to Rasmussen. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Here's a shot. Club save. Fabry's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Penalty coming up here. This is a frustrating situation, James. Just taking a whack load of penalties and really unable to get any momentum in this game because they're shorthanded the whole time. The Capitals send their man advantage unit out once more. Well, that's a tough one to take when you're five on three, but you still have a huge opportunity four on three, and this is where coaching comes in, James. You have to know how to settle your bench down and put the appropriate players out there. Pass back to the point. Washington's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. They're dropping the mids. Here we go. Well, the game got physical with that big hit. This is a challenge. Why not continue? And there's the takedown. I think not a moment too soon, at least with one of these fighters. Yeah, if you're the one that's underneath and on the ice, you want to take your five-minute ticket and march yourself over to the penalty box and get your rest. Well, some good punches were landed there, and he looks visibly shaken up. I think he's going to need some medical attention, James. At the very least, some ice packs. at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And he hangs on to the puck. Oh, what a smart heads-up play. The Capitals will play it from the defensive zone. And a successful clearing attempt. The Red Wings can't convert in the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Good stand-up hit on the play. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Here's a chance. Oh, tremendous reflexes with the pad. What a stop by Lyon. Great save from in tight. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point-blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Takes that pass back to the point. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Comfers won the draw. They'll look to set up. Stayed out. What a save! It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Washington's got some room to do something here on this power play as their penalty expired. Handles the puck. The Red Wings carry it along the wall. Hammers one, and he gets in front of the slap shot to make the save. 
Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Jostling for the puck and he loses control. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. He's got a step. Oh, the eyes him on the play. Uh, and this is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Both sides are evened up now as the power play expires. With possession along the wall. They score! And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift, and you can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. Uh, the goaltender has no chance on this one as his teammate just makes a gift of a pass right into his wheelhouse, and he just powders it by. The Red Wings have broken on through and have taken a one-goal lead here at late in period number two. Well, timing is everything, and this has been a scrappy game, James. You have to fight for every inch of ice that you get, so you know heading into this third period, they're going to have to come out on fire and willing to go to battle in the corners. Well, there's not much time here before the goaltender's eyes are taken away, James, and he drops into that butterfly position. All you want to do when you can't see the puck is make yourself as big as possible, but this one has seeing eyes through traffic and finds the back of the net. Washington's equalizer comes on a lot of hard work here in period number two. The coach will be happy with this performance, the pushback, the fight to claw their way back in late in the second, and this will set them up nicely for the third. Strom's won the draw inside the neutral zone. Poked away by Fabry. Taken by Sherratt. Puck scooped up by Fabry. Sends the pass over. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Anytime you're in the dying minutes of a period, you have to maintain your focus, especially when you're shorthanded. It's all about creating some momentum and killing the penalty. Special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Power play can be a real tone setter. This one, uh, just about average, James. Good part is, you know what? It's never 100%, but right now is what matters. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Steps inside the line. Centering feed. Picked off in front. Fabry's picking up momentum through center. From the point, looks to make something happen. Second intermission approaching quickly here. Takes the cross ice pass. And they clear that puck. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Well, it's tough timing to take a penalty at the end of a period. You want to make sure that you can reset and regroup, but first things first, you've got to kill the penalty. Detroit's got a five on three, and the clock's their BFF here. Comfort's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Close save. How did he get a piece of that? off a stick. Quick pass across to Gostaspair. Handles it along the blue line. And that shot dies in traffic. Great save by Lindgren. Desperately trying to escape the zone. And they get it done. Detroit's got control of it now from their own end. The Red Wings move the puck in the defensive zone. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Willamette's Recycling is a proud sponsor of tonight's game. Willamette's Recycling recycles enough paper to save more than 41 million trees. If you'd like to know more about their services, check out the website. Larkin 
he's not going to be able to return to the game, James. I mean, that injury that he suffered earlier is going to keep him out. This is a tough loss for their team. No, and you clearly kind of know where you stand from a coaching standpoint now, but that is a serious blow to the lineup here for the rest of the game. Oh, he got all that. What a save by Lindgren. You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. They'll get set to drop the puck as this power play continues. Washington's won the defensive zone draw. And they send it down the ice. Picked up along the wall by McMichael. Gets a pat on it. What a stop by Lyon. Tosses it to Comper. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. Takes the feed. Breaks up the play with a poke check. And now it's grabbed by Dostas Bear. Let's it go from the slot. That's blocked. Lindgren's got it and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he's been so dialed in all game, playing confident and controlled in the crease. McMichael's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Comfers won the draw and they're on the attack. Quick feed to Sprong. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Strom's back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. On the heels of their blades, trying to get it out. And he moves the puck across the blue line out of the defensive zone. Quick pass to Comper. Broken up by Jensen. Sprong's going to play it to the corner. Takes a shot. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Moves it quickly over to Gostaspare. And he stands tall in goal. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Face-off coming up here in the attacking zone. Well, they'll want to put their foot on the gas pedal here, sensing that the goaltender's overworked right now. And let's face it, he can't change. The Red Wings will start off on the attack after winning the draw. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Melinston's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. Well, that's a great job by the PK all the way from the entry, even once the power play unit got in. The ability to read the ice and know exactly where you want to go and where to pressure, that takes some skill. It's not just the power play that has it. Trust me, I know. Slides it diagonally to Rasmussen. Melenson's made a fantastic play, James, and he's falling to the ice. He's got the puck on his stick, and he still has the ability to lower that bottom hand and find a way to redirect the puck to the net. I mean, that's tenacity, that's courage, and finding a way to compete and will your way to the net. Grabbed along the board by Kopp. Poked away at center by Strom. Moves the puck. Great use of the stick at center by Rasmussen. And now he angles it across to Kane. Takes the feed at the point. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Detroit's won the draw and they'll go to work. Petrie's been tripped up and we got a penalty coming up here. Slides it across to Comper. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. get a hold of the puck along the boards gains the zone through the middle fires it love save made by Lyon and the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here 
Mumford's ready for the draw on this man advantage. The Capitals win the faceoff. Moves it to Sandine. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. And some good footwork to kick it away. Quick shot! Way too much congestion blocks that. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And they get it out of harm's way. The Red Wings gain control of the puck. Slides it up front. Slides the puck over. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Nice poke check. And he takes the feed. Came up with a nice save. Finds some space in the corner. Takes the pass. McMichael stick handling in his own zone. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. The Red Wings looking against the half wall. Putting the special and special teams, they take the lead. And often when you're on special teams, James, it can go either way in terms of the momentum. If you don't generate anything, it goes the other way. If you generate something, it's all in your favor. I'll tell you what, that was execution. The Red Wings have to be feeling good about themselves after taking the lead with that goal here in the third. Yeah, and it's not much of a cushion the way this game has gone back and forth, James, but it's something. You're in the lead, so now you want to continue with that tempo. Find a way to push your opponent back. Continue to punch and press. And now he moves it to Milano. And that puck leaves the zone. Grabbed in the open ice by Carlson. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Takes the return feed. Sends it over to Debrinkin. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Washington's got a hold of the puck. Takes a whack but still hangs on. Tries to feed it over to Milano. On the attack into the offensive end right up the gut. Detroit's in now. Taken along the wall by Edmondson. Angles it over to Ovechkin. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. And that pass attempt is deflected. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Centering pass! Feeds it to Kopp. He carries the puck up along the wing. Shot! Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Here's a shot! Stuffs him again! Goaltender covers up and will get a face-off. Detroit's got the edge in the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. LaPierre's won the draw here in their own zone. Slides the puck up from the left side. Grabs it in his own end. Puck grab by Wallman. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Let's see what the official makes for the final decision. They got to put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no question about it. They got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. once again send out their power play unit power play scored earlier tonight and that gives you so much confidence heading into this one you know how you executed the first time they'll look, be looking for those same openings Scores! and the power play comes up big again i love the various options that they have on their power play james once the pk adjusts to one they hit the other well, this power play is perfectly executed, James, but it all starts in the dot. You want to win that face-off because the setup, that's the most difficult part, and then they get all of the options ready that are...
player available to them, and they find a way to attack the net. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. The Capitals win possession here in the open ice. Quick feed to Strom. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Strom's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Makes it look easy with the stop. Here's a short pass to Rasmussen. Takes it off, but he's still got the puck. Oh, it's denied by Lyon. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. Ref's arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. Detroit's crossed the line and on the attack. And with the delayed penalty, and they score! They score on the delayed penalty, James, so that's going to negate their power play, but looks like they didn't need it. We don't get many odd man rushes throughout a game, James. You have to capitalize on your opportunity. I thought they executed perfectly. They didn't overpass. The right player took the right shot. The Red Wings are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. Works it across to Wilson. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. The Red Wings are across the line and into the offensive end. And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Across the line from center. Cut it to the slot. Oh, big time save by Lindgren. A timely save is everything to your team. And this goaltender, he bails his team out. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Penalty coming up. The Capitals cross the line and gain the zone. And they get the extra attacker out as the goaltender gets to the bench. There's the whistle, and here's the call. The Red Wings will be forced to serve two minutes for cross-checking. chance here on the man advantage power play has just been average tonight James not been really awful but certainly hasn't been great but that's the good part you can make a difference right now and he takes the feed that goes off a twig gets it out of his own end grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage McMichael's got it along the boards and it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads-up play there. The Capitals have it from their own end. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Stops him cold. Picked up along the boards by McMichael. Great hand now by the goaltender, poking it away. Well, a perfect setup for the one-timer here, but the goaltender makes a perfect read to make the save. Scooped up along the wall by Melenston. Quick pass to Ove Kubel. He scores! And he completes the hat trick! Well, he's been zipping and buzzing along the ice this entire night, hasn't he, James? And man, do the fans appreciate him. For an effective power play, you have to move the puck around with precision and you have to create some motion to open up lanes. That's exactly what happens here. They're able to get the puck to the middle of the ice and that's how they get the goal. The Capitals have to find a way to get a couple more here if they want to try to salvage this one. Taking calculated risks, James, and jumping into the attack and pressing upwards. Now, you may give up some opportunities the other way, but you got to go for it. Picked up along the wall by Mata. Puck picked up by Jensen. Quick pass to Edmondson. 
great hook by Fabry. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. The Red Wings are going to be shorthanded as they are called for tripping. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the faceoff. Well, sometimes it can be frustrating and it can give you energy. And this power play has just been average tonight, James. But the good thing, they have an opportunity right here to get above average. Grabbed along the boards by Ovechkin. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Quick pass across to Carlson. Scores! And there's another power play goal! Coaching staff has showed them video of how they want it executed, and they deliver tonight. Washington's got to be feeling good about themselves now, making this a one-goal game. Bench is up and stick taps all the way around, getting within one goal in the third period. You know how important this face-off is to get possession and start attacking in the O-zone. Taken by Gostas Bear. Moves it quickly over to Kopp. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. We got a penalty coming up here. Tries to get it over to LaPierre. Wilson's got the puck in his own zone. The Capitals played along the boards. Here he is on the backhand. Whistle blows, stopping the play. This is a tough situation to be in. You're frustrated. You're taking your third penalty of the period. You got to kill it, reset, and find a way to push on. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck. Wilson's made an incredible play there, James. He stumbles in front of the net, but finds the puck and could have lost it, but manages to stay with it enough to get a shot off. Reaches out and uses the stick. Dumps it in. The Capitals scoop it up along the boards. Moves it ahead from off the wall. The Red Wings take over on possession. Washington's got the puck. Here they come. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Stones up with the blocker. There's a collision along the boards, and there's a whistle from the officials as the pane of glass is cracked. Now, uh, remember back in the day, James, the thunder is hit, and all of a sudden the glass would explode or shatter? Well, not anymore, and that's a good thing. So there's not as much cleanup. They just have to replace the pane. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. The Red Wings win the draw here in their own end. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. Milano's going to play it against the half wall. That save. Oh, he got all of that one. This shot's coming from the middle of the ice, and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. Comfer's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Red Wings win the defensive zone faceoff. Trying to get the puck out of harm's way. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Well, the bench doesn't like this call, James. It's untimely to say the least with that one goal lead. Now, the PK unit, they got to get out there and they got to do a job. Washington's got a five on three and lots of time on their side. Five on three, you know your opponent has big bodies with long sticks in the middle of the ice. You have to find a way to move them. How do you do that? You either shoot the puck or you move it. Gets a pad on it and turns that one aside. And there's a shot, and the lane is clogged up blocking that. Made the stop on the play. And this is a dialed-in goaltender, very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot, and makes the save. Moves it to McMichael. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Cuts into the paint. Oh, what a save on the play. Wow. Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. He scores. There's the hat trick in left Rain Chapeaux. Yeah, Rain Chapeaux is right there. Hats all over the ice. They're going to have to collect them. Take some time, but man, has he ever had an effective night? He had two, and he was thinking.
and three all the way. Coaches are always harping on pass execution. Well, this is a clear example when the pass is crisp and it's on the tape, it's on the money, it finds the back of the net. The Capitals' perseverance pays off as we are tied here in the back half of the third. Perseverance, you said it, just finding a way to get it done and stick with it. That's what they've done, and they found themselves here. They've got the equalizer now. It's a matter of now attacking and finding a way to get on top. And that's knocked away by Comfort. Drives it to the crease. Taken along the wall by Mana. Here's a shot. And that goes off the glove. Play continues here. A chance in front. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Get the Capitals have it in the offensive end. Off the glove and the puck skips away. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Pacioretty's moving the puck through his own zone. To his teammate. Oh, he saved him. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Carlin Bade is standing by with who she thought had the better performance. Carson's a great player when he gets engaged, and he has been that tonight with the offensive side of this game. I've been impressed with his performance. And they'll start with possession. Here's a chance. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Lyon. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. The Capitals win that offensive zone face-off. Puck scooped up by Ovechkin. Great forecheck by Obe Kubel. Picked up along the boards by Sprong. Milano's taking it from his own end. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more. Washington's got a five on three, but not a lot of time to work with. A short five on three, James. You got to win this face off. Possession is key. If it goes 200 feet the other way, you just killed your opportunity. Playing big in the moment there. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Siders out of the box, but they're still short handed as he steps in to help try to kill off this penalty. Strom's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Washington's got possession of the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Here's a shot. Snagged with the glove by Lyon. Polano's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Detroit's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And they get the puck out of the zone, and that's a break for the squad. Oh, uh, yeah, this PK unit, they're out there for a reason, James. You have to be able to clear the puck, and it's easier said than done, but they make no mistake this time. Sent into the offensive zone. Washington's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick feed to Pacioretty. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Strom. Sends the pass in front. Great defensive hits up play to pick it off. And they manage to clear it. Washington's got possession of the puck. Slides it diagonally to Wilson. Looks to set up at the point now. And he makes the save. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? 
Fisher's gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. They move the puck out of harm's way. The Capitals move it ahead. And the puck's kicked free. Can't get a hold of that pass. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Gets it over to McMichael. Takes a shot. Here's a shot. And he comes up with the glove save. Fisher's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Strom. And that's poked away by Sandine. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Here's a short pass to Wilson. Takes a shot. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. And a solid effort by the penalty killers as we are back to even strength. Well, it's just been an average night on the PK, but you know how your numbers get better? You get one right there, and they did a good job to be able to kill that one off. Across the line along the left wall. And he loses control here. Wilson's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Pacioretty. Oh, great core strength to hang onto the puck after that. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. This is the best part of the game. It's really tight. It's down the stretch. One mistake either way will be the difference maker. Made that stop. A critical draw here. Detroit's won the draw. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Gets the puck in deep. Washington's got a hold of the puck now. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Into the corner of the attacking area. Passes the puck over to Sherratt. Picking up momentum inside the neutral zone. On the attack along the boards. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Here's a shot. Blocked in traffic. Quick pass to Kopp. Poked away at center by Edmondson. The Capitals gain control of it. Through pass ahead. Gaining momentum along the wing. The Capitals take it along the wall. The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, and this has been trending to happen, James. I mean, closing on the puck quickly sends an upward trajectory as this game's progress and they find the back of the net. Well, this is just a perfect screen. The goaltender can't find the puck because the screen is looking back and finding a way to take away his eyes. Does a great job, and the puck goes in. Washington's gone up by one here in period number three. Well, and you know that they recognize that they've got the lead in the third period, so they have to be defensively responsible, but you can't just sit back and protect. you got to be aggressive when you get the moment and take advantage of it. Protus works the puck in his own zone. The Capitals take possession in the defensive end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Detroit's grabbed a hold of the puck. Pass across to Debrinkit. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Shot! And it goes off a stick. And that's blocked in traffic. Tries to get it out of harm's way. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. The Red Wings have had more scoring chances, and yet they trail late in this third period. Mike. 
Michaels won the draw at center. Takes the feed from the left side. Detroit's in transition. Moves it quickly over to Debrinkit. Slip feed. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Washington's moving it up the ice. Sends a pass over with the stop. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Washington's got a hold of it along the wall. The Capitals ready to go on the attack. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. And he sends it across to Sider. Gaining momentum up along the side. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Washington's moving it along the wing. Shot stops that one. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Detroit's going to start with the puck in their own end. Gostas Bears got it in the defensive end. Moves the puck along the half wall. Chance in front. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. What a fantastic save from a high-danger scoring area, James. And, I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Washington's won the face-off deep in their own end. And he takes the pass. Detroit's got the puck. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. Cops got it against the boards. Sends it to the middle. Picked off in front. Moves it to Edmondson. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Great pass from off the right side. Here's a shot. Just wide. Scooped up along the wall by Mata. He carries the puck up along the wing. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Fabry's trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. And now it's grabbed by Milano. Moves it on over to Pacioretty. The Red Wings look to start the transition game. Washington's number one line has been dominant tonight, James. They've been in the offensive zone. They've created a ton of opportunities, and they're a reason why they're in the lead. Great reach with the poke check by Gostas Bear. Can't keep a hold of it. Denied by the goaltender. Big save by the goaltender once again. Man, James, he shows him. Look at this, two on one. Kane's his own. Blocked with a capital B ending that rush. Back at the point, they set it up. There's another stop. Lindgren's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been outstanding all game, James. There's a reason why his team is leading in this one. And elects to with a good decision to get the face off. The Red Wings have been the more active team offensively tonight with plenty of scoring chances, but they continue to trail because they haven't finished late in this third period. Scrum ensues along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Fisher. From the slot! An absolutely critical strike here in the third. Yeah, and really important that they didn't get frustrated. They just trusted the process, and they found themselves getting the equalizer. Now there's a lot of game to be played to try and win it. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. The Red Wings weren't ready to go home, and they weren't planning on rolling over in this one tonight. Look at this, Cheryl. I know my parents used to say, keep the pedal to the metal, and this is exactly what they have to do with that urgency. They score the equalizer, and now they've got the momentum to try and win it all. And that goes off course off a body. Washington's got the puck against the half wall. Quick feed to McMichael. This one's still up for grabs as we approach the final minute. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. 54 seconds. Poked away in the defense.
defensive end. The Capitals pick up steam and are on the attack. Moves into the slot. Takes a shot. Off the mask and he keeps it out. Then Reem's got to find a way to physically and emotionally engage without his fist, James. I mean, you know how effective and how valuable he is when he's on the ice. I mean, look at that scoring chance he just generated. Lindgren's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Zone face off. Washington's got the puck after winning the defensive zone face off. Here they come up along the wing. Sends it out front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Lions opted to hang on to the puck for a face off. This is a face off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. What a big draw on their own end. And loses possession after a solid hit. Here's a short pass to Delano. Made the save on the play. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Strong's got the puck and they'll go on the attack. Here's a blast. And that goes off the post and out. There's the horn for regulation, and it solves nothing. Overtime coming up right after this.